are learning more tonight about the tense moments that led to four people shot in Parkway Village. The victims are telling investigators two men tried to carjack them. WRG Shea Arthur is live tonight with the latest on this case. And Shay, what have you uncovered? Hey, Greg. Hey, Stephanie. Well, last check with police. Those four victims are recovering tonight after, so after it sounds like a very scary situation in one neighborhood. Outside this Parkway Village home off Dungreen, you can still see shreds of crime scene tape. Medical gloves litter the yard, and what looks to be a bullet hole is left in the back of this pickup truck. Neighbors who did not feel comfortable going on camera told us they heard at least 20 gunshots Saturday night. Initially, Memphis police told us they responded to a scene a mile away at the corner of Goodlett and Sheffield around 9.30 Saturday night. They found three men with gunshot wounds. One man shot in the arm, a second in the head, and a third to his abdomen. When I saw him put the crime scene tape up and all the ambulances came, um, yeah, I knew something had went on, but I didn't hear anything other than, you know, all the sirens when the police were coming. We're now learning the victims told officers they were sitting in a truck outside the nearby home we visited today when two men showed up demanding the truck. When the group refused and tried to run away, the men shot into the truck several times, the victim stopping at the intersection of Goodlett and Sheffield. A fourth shooting victim later showed up at the hospital. During their investigation, police tell us they also located a stolen handgun. And Stephanie Gregg, last check, no one has been arrested. Of course, if you know anything, you're asked to call Crime Stoppers. That number is 901-528-CASH. We're live downtown tonight. Shay Arthur, WREG, News Channel 3.